where do I start? As Doug said, I was in New York um, in 2001, and I, I saw the attack. Uh, I witnessed it firsthand. I was actually at home in the East Village when I heard that a tower had struck the World Trade Center. And I uh, went up to the roof of my apartment building in the East Village to see the second plane strike the South Tower. And it's one of those things that you, um, you never forget. Um, And as horrifying and awful as it was to see that, what I also saw in New York in the days and weeks and months that followed was actually incredibly uplifting. The way the city came together, the way we all came together in the wake of that attack. And, um, and I couldn't have believed it myself if you would have told me uh, the, sort of the transformation that I felt personally as somebody who'd been living in New York for about three years, that sense of connection to other New Yorkers, um, that sense of, of a community. And what you saw in New York was something that I hope you see in the memorial, was this, uh, a stoicism, a defiance, but also incredible compassion, a way in which we came together. And I was so moved by what I had seen that I wanted to, uh, to imagine a memorial. And, uh, a few months after the attack, I started to sketch uh, ideas for memorial.